East Bay is a low budget indie film that I almost want to say, like, I suspect that the title of East Bay was, like, not chosen by the filmmaker, but by the distributor. Because so many times throughout the movie, they just keep repeating this line of, like, mediocre middle-aged man. And I, I almost think that that was the intended title for this movie. But it's, a, it's about a bunch of middle-aged men who are failures in life and kind of grappling with, so nobody told you life was gonna be this way. <laughs> no, um, but not in the happy, you know, 90s sitcom friends way, just in the general, oh yeah, okay, life does kind of suck and I didn't make anything of my life. And especially for the main character, he's Asian and he dealt with, you know, the overbearing parents who wanted him to, you know, succeed and he's done nothing with his life. He's an aspiring filmmaker, but like nobody likes his films. He struggles to relate well to women. And the film has unfortunate, like, misogynist tendencies in terms of the way that all of the women are portrayed in the film. They're pretty much all some flavor of histrionic. And I, I, I think the film tries to backpedal on that a little bit by revealing that the main character is an unreliable narrator. Uh, but I don't know how much that actually does to to counter the issues. Like, I really, really hated how all of the women in this movie were written. It kind of, the film kind of feels a little autobiographical. I don't know all that went into making it. I think that the, the, the star of the, of the movie was also directing and writing it but I could be mistaken. It, it just felt like he has some unresolved issues with women that he was working out here and maybe tried to downplay it by saying that he, the main character himself is also an asshole and unreliable. So the women that we see them in the film aren't how the women actually are, but it's his distorted viewpoint of how they are. But like, that might just be cope. Yeah, I didn't really like this one and I can't recommend it that much. Hey, thanks for watching. Your view means a lot. Don't forget to toss me a like and subscribe and ring the bell and drop a comment below telling me what you thought of the video. I stream Mondays and Fridays at 5 p.m. Pacific, so catch me live and join in on the convo. You can find all my socials in the description below and thank you to all my patrons with a very special shout out to my whale shark tier patrons Ms. Milena and Hella Vitrum and my anemone friend tier patrons Piftle Cakes and Geek Filter. Your support means the world. Catch you next time.